In a related development, residents of Lakeside Estate Communities 4 and 5 in Adenta Municipality are trapped in their homes after a heavy downpour Sunday night. According to residents, the area floods every time it rains, making it practically impossible to move out of their homes. This, however, the worst they have experienced. Reports indicate that some estate officials, including an engineer, have been to the area, visited some of the homes to estimate the extent of damage. Let's go on to the phone lines now. We are joined by Christopher Ohene Nyako, who is uh, one of the many affected homeowners. Uh, Christopher, thank you very much for joining us here on Joy News Prime. Uh, you have been trapped in your home for how many days now? Um, actually, the waters have receded, so we are out of the, the house now. Great, that is some good news. But, but tell us, how many days uh, did you have to stay indoors because of the floodwaters? Um, thankfully, it actually didn't last for um, a day. It happened within the afternoon, mm. and then um, the rooms were actually flooded, so we had to stay in there for the waters to recede before um, we... Uh, could come out. If your rooms got flooded and we are seeing some of the visuals on there, uh, describe yeah. to us the things that you have lost as a result of this uh, flooding incident. Um, I could mention a lot of electrical gadgets, my uh, fridges, my uh, laptops. I mean, I could go on and on, not to even talk about clothes, not to talk about certificate books, everything actually. Mm. Uh, and from what we understand, it floods every time it rains. Uh, how long have you lived in the area, and what, in your estimation, may be you know accounting for this? Okay, so um, personally, I have lived in the, the house. Actually, belongs to us, and then we gave it. We used to give it out for rent. So residents who have been in the house, uh, uh, usually all the time that it rains, the place gets flooded. And um, this, is the sec this is the third time that uh, the walls have broken in the house. And uh, what, what is accounting for this situation is that there is, um, the drainage system is really not the best. Mm. The level of water that flows in any time it rains is quite, it's too much for the drainage system. And someone has also actually built on the waterway, mm -hmm. making the gutters very narrow. And so the waters receding is actually a problem, causing mm. the build-up behind our wall, thereby breaking the wall and then the waters coming in. Very well. Uh, Christopher, thank you very much for speaking to us and we're glad that you're safe. Uh, we'll be following up on this once we understand that some officials have been there to assess the situation.